Yes, hi, uh, this is Dr. Shahar Khan. I just finished an end block on the right and also on the left with a very nice, pleasant uh, lady. Uh, she uh, came to me with the classic signs of breast implant illness. And, you know, I did resect uh, the capsule off. What I find interesting, as you will see, there's a lot of suture that I find that the previous surgeon left behind. And um, this is something that I find is abnormal. This is the capsule. As you can see, there's some areas that are transparent and areas that are very thick. But as you will see, this is the suture material uh, that I'm going to literally pull out, uh, which is uh, consistent with what is ethabound suture, very thick, normally not used. Uh, but uh, I found that this was pretty much uh, all over uh, the capsule. Now, I did resect in a similar fashion. These uh, capsules are going to be going back to uh, to the pathologist. And look, if you will, uh, the th areas of thickness and relative thinness. Now, to my surprise today, as I did, you can see some actual bubbles within the implant itself. You can see, uh, make out uh, their air pockets, bubbles, one, two, three, four that I see. Now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you, I'm checking for any abnormality or leak. And as you can see right here, uh, that actually there is a small, very small, uh, very small uh, leak that I just noticed when I pressed right here. And this is basically uh, the purpose of doing this in a very nice systematic way. And look, this is more fluid that's pouring out rather than consistent with what is what I would call the cohesiveness of a silicon implant. So as you can see right here, this is more fluid coming out uh, rather than uh, the silicon. And again, as you will see, this is going to literally pour out like water. And this is where that break and the bubbles are present. Uh, and this was the part where they had more, as you can see, there is the small uh, crack slash break in the implant right there. Uh, so uh, the implants are going to be returned to the patient. And uh, I am uh, going to go ahead and uh, send the capsules off, like I said, to pathology. Again, very interesting case. All contained, there is no rupture or slash leakage within the chest cavity, hence the, uh, the benefit and the true indication of doing an end block which is the best and the only way uh, to do this operation definitively hopefully you found this useful thank you again very much dr khan from executive plastic surgery uh khan plastic surgery academy on the youtube channel thanks bye bye